Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I want to talk about something that's got me thinking a little kind of. I went out a few days ago. Um, it was a comedy show. Well, it wasn't just a comedy show, it was uh, poetry night, some singing, it was all different acts. But at one particular time, there was a comedian came on, and um, it was in a bar. And there was, I'd say, about 90% women and 10% guys in the place. And now, uh, it was, say, about 98% black women in the place. And now the comedian, he asked a question. You know, comedians like to ask the audience questions. He said, all the people in here who are single, raise your hand. I looked around and damn near every hand went up. And I was like, woo, is this the state of things now? What's going on? What's going on when you're in a room and 90, 90, about 90% 90 of people are single and there was a crowd of about say from about 22 to to the 30s um, and there's yeah so but as the night pose pro progressed actually I was there with a woman she wasn't my girlfriend just a friend of mine actually a white girl a friend of mine I have friends of all different races. She she was there with me at the time. Um, she's a singer as well. But it made me think, what what is it that's going on? But there were certain things that I picked out that I didn't like in the attitude of a lot of the women in there. I mean, for instance, there was one guy. He was singing. He was singing. He was on the stage singing. Uh, light skinned guy, good looking guy, whatever, whatever, good singer, but there was women laughing, laughing loud, I mean not laughing at him, but laughing in their conversations and making it really loud that the laughing was almost louder than the singing, and now to me, I don't know about other people, but that's just damn rude, that's like, that's disrespectful and rude, man, is performing for you and you're laughing and making noise I mean if you want to laugh you can always laugh quietly if you have a little joke between your friends you don't have to you know make it louder than the singing I just couldn't comprehend that like where is that attitude where does that attitude come from and there's another thing I want to talk about what is this all this Nicki Minaj Barbie doll thing. Barbie doll? Like it's cool to be a Barbie doll? What's that about? So it's cool now to be fake. Have fake hair, fake nails, fake breasts, fake this, fake that. That's like, if you have all these fake stuff, how are you going to even know who you are? How are you going to even identify yourself? You'll be confused. Is it cool to be confused? Or is that what it's about being a woman these days? What kind of movement is this Nicki Minaj and her Barbie doll movement trying to bring? And and the guys that like these Barbie dolls, you know, they can't even put their hand through their hair because the hair is not real and they don't want them to touch it. And all this other nonsense. These guys are just straight up idiots promoting this nonsense. I don't know man. I'm very analytical. I analyze things and I see these things and it, it just doesn't make no sense to me. I mean they say men work off logic a lot more and women work off emotions. So I guess a lot of this Barbie stole stuff is just out of emotions and no real logic to it. I mean, how logical is it to to get, to tie someone else's hair to your head, like some Indian lady's hair to your head, or have some silicone put in your chest? 
there's no logic to that it's all emotion because it makes you feel better feel better not be better but feel better because you'll get more so called attention from these suckers who like all this fake stuff I don't know I don't know what is wrong with being organic what is wrong with being real and true to yourself because to me that puts me off of a woman that says to me you don't know you don't have no clue who you are you're, you're a confused person it shows a confused personality which I don't know <laughs> I don't know I mean unless you're only looking for someone with no personality just a body then that's the type of guy you're gonna attract I don't know what's going on. I don't know. There's a lot of guys talking on these things. I know us guys ain't perfect as well, but we're all analytical. I mean, I'm sure there's some things that women can analyze about men, but this is definitely something that's just going too far now. Barbie movement. <laughs> Come on. That's just way too much. I don't know. I don't know when things change. Peace out.